Yes, sir, man. You know what time it is, man. It is the host with the most coast to coast cutting the close to anything and leaving you shaving the toast. I am back in action. Let's make it happen. <laughs> you need a stretch, and I got the magic. You dig me? I am on vacation. It is 4th of July at the same time, but it's up early. You know, normally I get up at 8 o'clock because I go to work at 10, but I got up at 8 today. Spent 30 minutes on the phone looking around, checking notifications. You know, checking the trap. You feel me? Checking the trap. We're just going to start the day off. We're going to start hustling. Start to finish. You know what I'm saying? At least to the afternoon. Martha said the blight had spread even further south. Pushing yet more monsters down with it. I dare say we'll be seeing a few along the way. Who we got over here? Come here, boy. Oh, shorty, I always catching them. They always finishing them off before I get that last one in. Oh, you think I ain't gonna get my XP? Burn out! Yeah! That's how I play it anyway. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how everybody else do it, but... I play it. I play it like that. Hmm. Get him out of that coach. Yeah. On to the next one, gang. Yes! Yeah, where we going? Oh yeah, we out here. Burn out! Woo! Get him out of there. He gone, boy. He gone. He gone, boy. He gone. Hee <laughs> hee. My boy be kicking that chest open like Michael Jess. Coach, get him out of there. Okay. <laughs> All right. What we got over here? What is this? Tis a green question mark. You there? Over here. You have a quest here, Frederick. Excuse me. I'll use that blade of yours. Curse my luck. I branded. Hmm. No time to hide whoever holds your leash. Wait. That's the slumbering chocobo you're wearing. You in the Marfrys, are you? Good. She won't begrudge me the use of you, then. Mm. Not while there's wounds about. We tried dealing with them ourselves. Made out bait. Think we might swoop in and slaughter a lot. But 
We didn't expect the park to be quite so bloody big. I expect the blight drove them here. They must have fled their homes for greener pastures. Well, we'd hoped empty bellies might make them easy prey. We'd made them mean instead. Martha's no fool, so she must see something in you. Do us a favor and get rid of them, will you? Hmm. Oh, for that? Shit, man. Okay. I suppose those walls pose a threat to everyone. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. I'd wager the greedy bastards are still over yonder, finishing off our bait. Mm. Hmm. When you seen him, all right? All right, man, let me get my bread in. Let me get my bread in. Yeah. Oh, where, oh, where did the woofies go? Oh, where, oh, where could they be? Oh, where, oh, where is my flaming sword? Oh, where, oh, where could I be? Yeah, 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 yeah! Starting off this madness early! Oh, so you must be the star, and you must be the leader of the pack, huh? Yes! Get out of here, wretched scum! Filthy beast! Yeah, hey, y'all got going on over here. Y'all just chilling with the apps. I said, get over here. I'm done with you yet. I'm not done with you yet. Find this Bryce. Let him know the road's safe. Yeah, I need my bread too. Oh, hey, somebody ran me my coins. Ooh, hold up, side street. Ooh, ha 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 ha. Let's get rid of the ops first. Okay, get him out the way. Sorry, shorty. Damn. Shorty says sorry back. Sorry, old chum. Oh, shit. Ah, I hit circle instead of an R1. No. Garuda, tame this filthy beast. Woo, come here. Fang over fang. Yes. Burn out. I'll be fine now. Damn it, phone. No. Garuda, tame this beast! Flame! No! Oh, that's how you do that! No. Beast, be tamed. Yes. Oh, nasty. Yeah. Yeah. 
the comments start flowing when you get a little bit known what you're doing, huh? Oh, we got another one over here. Oh, ho, oh, ho. Oh. Not done with you yet. Not done with you yet, beast. Let me turn my notifications off, gang. Hold on. Because I swear I had them off, but obviously I didn't. All right, let's get it. Cut those. Wake wins. Damn. Ooh. -wee. You'll pay for that. You'll pay for that. No. Baruta, tame this beast. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That'll help. Ah, hey. Boy, hit me ain't gonna hold you. Burn out, divine slashes. Come here. Come here. No. No. Tame, you beast. Burn out. Yes. No. Come here. Sit down, boy. Burn out. Slap shot. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Mash D. Did him dirty. Yeah, I'm looking for you. Yeah, that's what I'd like to see. I'm out here in these streets. I'm out here in these streets. <laughs> I'm out here in these streets. I'm out here in the streets. Oh, we got a cave. Nah, that's just you. We talked to you already. What's this? It's the uh -oh. same as the one back at the hideaway. Doesn't seem to be working now. Hmm. Okay. Okay, okay. We got the dragon over here, huh? This won't be easy. Ooh. Damn. Okay. Come here, beast. Yeah. Yeah. No. No. Yes. Burn out. Mm -mm, come here. Woo. No. Thought you were just gonna attack me. 
Yes. So that you filthy beast. Burn out. I said, come here. Oh, I said, come here. Ooh. Yeah, what you was over here hiding, man? <laughs> All right, now let's get back to our business. Check my time while I'm at it, chat. Oh, man, I'm in the building, man. I ain't I get my XP up. Well, when y'all boys play these RPG games, boy, y'all better start hitting them side streets. Getting your XP up. I, I like to be, you know what I'm saying? I like to grind so much to where I'm like, I get to the, I get to a boss, I'm five levels higher than him. You feel me? Cause sometimes you be on Struggle Street, and then you gotta go level up. Man, what you say, bro? You mumbling your breath. Bryce. What's it to you, Bearer? Your friend asked me to get rid of the wolves. So I got rid of the wolves. You'd have me believe a single Bearer slew the entire pack. Then again, if you didn't, you wouldn't be on this side of the bridge. Duh. Bugger me, you're a tough one, aren't you? <laughs> oh, Frederick. You oily bastard. I never thought to pit beast against beast like that. You served us well, Bearer. Be sure to pass our thanks to your master. Boy, give my damn money. Now oh, the rest of what you talking about is irrelevant. In my bread. Be gone with ya. Alright, let's see. We're making our way to East Look, Pool. The windmills. That must be Eastpool. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Where you going, boy? Boy? About to get dirty with you, boy. About to get dirty. The hell is this? Right, some zebra elves. Yeah. What was all that damn noise? Who was that? Was that them? Or I was them animals, I something like that. Lord Murdoch when I was young. Rosaria seemed a very different place back then. I know this wasn't the training ground, was it? Was this the training ground from like when we first started? Baby, this is the grass. Grass. Look a little yellow. Nah, you know what I'm saying? I ain't a farmer or nothing, so. Ooh. See that ocean? Well, I was trying to see the ocean view, but. Ace pool? Quiet, isn't it? So I like it. Clive Rossfield. Hmm. Who, who know me? Huh? It 
It's me, Hannah, Rodney Murdoch's wife. Lady Hannah. Oh, I knew it was you. You haven't changed at all. The Lord Marquis and Jill too. It's so good to see you both again. <gasps> don't cry, baby. Don't cry. It's good to see you too, Lady Hannah. <gasps> if you have time, you simply must come back to the house. I haven't much to offer, but what is mine is yours. <laughs> we should be delighted. And you have been wandering the world ever since. I can well understand fleeing from those iron blood brutes, but oh, to take to the road at such a tender age. Yeah, do what you gotta do, but ain't like I necessarily just volunteered. It uh, wasn't easy. We survived, and... And now we're back. It's wonderful to see you safe and well, Lady Hannah. <laughs> I hate this brand off my face, bro. I need to burn it. Do you think you will stay here? In East Pool. That'd be Rosalind a dope score. enjoys the Mother Crystal's blessing, does it not? You could always move. This house holds a lot of memories for me. So long as I can live here in peace, here I shall stay. Not that it matters. The capital is closed to civilians by order of the Duchess. Or should I say, Her Imperial Majesty. Mm, that bitch. Annabella's marriage to the Emperor of Sambrec heralded a great many changes here. Yes. Of course. Oh, forgive me. I, I didn't mean to. Oh. Please. There is nothing to forgive. That bitch sold me out a long time ago. Would my mother not make an exception for you and your husband? Surely she would not refuse the Lord Commander. Oh, she. Oh. You haven't heard then. Rodney passed away on the night of the fire. He never returned from Phoenix Gate. Mm. He burnt him up. I, I'm sorry. Clive. My poor child, you look pale. All this traveling must have taken its toll. I insist you rest. We can talk later. That boy ain't paired up, boy having flashbacks. His palms are sweaty. Knees weak, arms is heavy. <laughs> Let me stop, man. I'm stupid. Let me start. Oh, yeah. Sure I can't. Not after what I did. Lady Hannah said she would prepare a change of clothes for you in the morning. She really has been very kind. Damn, my boy been on the street. Jack the Ripper with it. Years without the faintest glimmer of hope. It was only Joshua that kept me going. 
I swore that I would avenge his death. That I would kill his killer. That was the only thing that gave my life any meaning. But if it was me who killed Joshua and Murdoch and all the others, then why the hell am I still breathing? I ask myself the same. When I fought, hundreds died. There were so many bodies, so many lives cut short in their prime. That day in Dalmechia, I... I wanted to join them. I wanted it all to end. I couldn't bear it anymore. If living meant being that, better to be just another body. I'm sorry. Do you remember that night on the balcony? When we looked up at the moon? Yeah, that boy was in his bag, but he couldn't I say nothing. prayer to Metia and that prayer was answered. You came back to me. The heavens must have a plan for us. Well, you better kiss your girl, man. Are oh, you folded? We should get some rest. Right. You folded. That girl praying for you. That girl worried for you. Well, you, well at least you could have did. We gave her a ah, dang. Boy, you could have gave her a smooch, man. Kiss on the forehead, some. Sorry, though. I know my boy time coming. Thank you. Ooh! Thank you. Now people will not flee at the sight of me. You look just like Elwyn did when he was your age. How did you come to have some of my father's old clothes? Ooh! Swaggy! When Elwyn became Archduke. Our families would often summer together. He and Rodney were like brothers. These clothes have been in a wardrobe for years, collecting cobwebs along with everything else. Well, I'm very grateful for them. And sorry for depriving you of your memories. Not at all. It's what your father would have wanted. That boy drip. Drip McGee. I was just gonna cut that damn hell. Thank you, Lady Hannah. Yes, thank you. You've been most kind. No, I should thank you. It may only have been for a short while, but seeing you again took me back to happier times. Fare you well, my lord and lady. I love her, man. Her spirit is dope. Lady Hannah. Oh, hey, we got a new sword, too. We oh. Let me peek my she boy Drip. Phoenix Gate. Let's go. Drip McGee. Ooh, wee. Drip McGee. Ooh, wee. Boy, listen, 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 listen. That's why I draw my anime. See, as a recent, we're going to walk and talk though. As a recent, I love. Let me hold on. Let me check my boy Drip. He got the dagger on the side. Ooh, wee. Got the gauntlets. Got the armor pieces. That boy is dripped out. This is why I draw my characters with capes, boy. Because capes, well, recently, anyway. 
my recent character he got a cape because capes is like that you gas those are elwins by the flames you're his firstborn clive rosfield you're mistaken oh you can't fool me my lord mm. you're the very image of your father and that would be true even if you weren't wearing his clothes the self-same garments Hannah was keeping for you, if I'm not mistaken. She always swore that she would never part with them until the day Elwyn's sons returned. And now that day has come. <laughs> Why, you'll be able to take your bearers back as well. My bearers? Hmm? What you my old man? Forgive me, Master Mayor. I was a child when last I came to Eastpool. I didn't recognize you. Oh, I'd be surprised if you recognized anything at all. Much has changed since Rosaria fell to the Empire. Not least for the bearers who once served her noble families. When the Iron Blood sacked Rosalith 13 years back, Many who lost their masters fled here, in search of sanctuary. And never returned. Aye. The plan was to send them home once we'd won back the capital. But then the Imperials arrived. Rosaria became a province of San Brec. The duchy was dissolved, and they no longer had any home to return to. Back in your father's day, any bearer who lost their master became a ward of the duchy. Mm. We'd hand them over to the sheriffs, and they'd be assigned a new position. But when we saw how the Empire treated their branded, we knew that wasn't an option. So they've been here ever since. And now you want to give them to me? They're yours by right, Lord Rosfield. Bequeathed you by your late father. And they'd be better off serving you than hiding here. Indeed, many of them used to serve your house and still consider the Rosfields their masters. I'm no one's master. Not anymore. They wouldn't be safe with me. I understand. You'll forgive an old man his fanciful notions been daydreaming for too long but still I would ask a favor of you a small mercy if it is within my power one of the bearers is an elderly fellow who still swears absolute loyalty to Archduke Elwyn I don't ask that you take him into your service only that you meet with him let him see that Elwyn's son still lives and that he's as fine a man as his father ever was. It would be my honor. Thank you, my lord. He sits by the well most days, watching the people go about their business. If you could show him your face, I would be most grateful. All right, let's get Ooh, 1200. Hell yeah, I should what, guess the parents. She will say less. Check my time. As fine a man as my father. You're not so very different, you know. Especially dressed like that. Come on. Let's yeah. go and meet that bear. I got me dripped up. Hmm. He's not here. Well, I can't leave without meeting him. I've let the mayor down once already. It would be cruel to disappoint him again. Right, let's ask around. Someone must have seen him. Boy, boy done picked a day to play hooky. I'm out here wasting my time, thug. Well, now. Unfamiliar faces. What brings you to Eastpool, travelers? We're looking for an elderly bearer. You wouldn't happen to have seen him, would you? 
<clears throat> you mean the old boy who always waits by the well? Yeah. Yes, that's him. What, uh, what business do you have with him? Yeah, he you knows. Know asking. You're not from the capital too, are you? We are, in a way. Well then, it's a pleasure to meet a fellow Rosalithian. I was born and raised down Market Street. I never would have left if Archduke Elwyn had survived the fire. Mm. They weren't the same when the Duchess took over, though. All the beatings, the evictions, the levies going up and up and up, even as the blight took half the harvest. Oh, listen to me, telling you what you already know. I'm sorry. I'm afraid I can't help you with your bearer, either. Though I doubt he'll have gone far. He comes here every day, almost as if he's waiting for something. We'll keep asking around, then. Thank you. <sighs> Good day, milady. What can I do for you? I'm looking for a bearer, an elderly fellow who used to serve the Rosfields. Have you seen him? Ah, that old loon. No, no sign of him today. Funny, he's usually down by the well at this hour, cooking up his fantasy feasts. Mm. I'm sorry. Oh, he worked in the kitchens at Rosalith Castle back in the day. Still thinks he's there now. <laughs> You'll often hear the poor fool chatting away to the Archduke. Living in a dream, he is. But better there than here, I suppose. Can't imagine the Viceregent stopping to trade tales with a bearer. Can you? No. Anyway, you'll be round here somewhere. Doubt he has the path to stray too far. Thank you. We'll keep looking. You hate him? Hold on a mo. Young Patrick, the chocobo keeper, might know where he is. He's taken the old bird under his wing, so to speak. <laughs> He'll be in the stables. You should go and have a word with them. Right. Patrick, the chocobo keeper. Thank you. We will. Appreciate you, Slick. Information was useful. I'm sorry, Jill. For making you do all this in my stead. It can't be helped if we're to keep up the pretense. Come on, let's head for the stables. Ah, right, here we go. Bloody hell's he got to? Damn, you don't know either, bro. Excuse me, but is something the matter? It's this bearer I've been minding. I take my eyes off him for one minute and he disappears. He's not in his usual spot by the well, nor anywhere else in the village. You must be Patrick. I am, but... And this bearer you're looking for... He's an elderly man who used to work in the Rosalith Castle kitchens, yes? That's the fella. Mm. How do you know all this? I've never seen him in his pool there you go, my your business. You seem to know the place better than I do myself. My your business, thug. So that's how it is. Well then, if you're acting under orders of the mayor, you're on about to help me find him. He's been losing what little sense he had left of late, saying the sheriffs are coming to collect him and that he needs to go back to the castle. I was supposed to watch over him, keep him out of trouble. But if he's walked out on us, there's not a lot I can do. Mm -hmm. Well. Understood. We just want to go find the old we'll boy. Thank you. I'm in your debt. I hope he hasn't wandered into trouble. Let's just concentrate on finding him. Alright. Yeah. I'm going to swindle down the street. The broken hilt. The broken hilt, that lot of. Yeah, we just came What's from this way. Sign? Could he have strayed even further? Hope not. I 
I wish I had like a speed booster. My boy would be. Alright, so so we gotta go back up. So we gotta make our way back up. We gotta make our way back up. We gotta make our way back up. Mm -mm. I want a sword that got like some elements on it, like you know what I'm saying, like some electricity or something, like. Some, some like your sword has a high chance of doing uh, molten crit damage or electric shock who up here three pinches three pinches of the old magic three pinches Six rare climb shells. Look, there's someone over there. It might be him. We should hurry. Oh, my boy got the forehead, forehead. Company. Oh, they got they got super skeeters. Agreed. Oh, they got super skeeters out here. Get out of here. Burn out. Oh, I'm about to say somebody gonna feel it. It's over. Yes. Get out of here, stupid wolf! Mind your beast! Enemies have been slain. Give me my spoils. I'm taking my time. What's up, OG? Oh, I'm bored by the end of that one. Are you alright, my friend? Come on. Let's go home. Your grace. You came for me. I waited for you so long, but you finally came. I'm not who you think. Clive. You are. Yes. Pray forgive my long delay. It's nothing, Your Grace. I prayed to the founder that you would come, and at long last, he answered. Will we be returning to the castle then? There is still a place for me in the kitchens? No, my friend. We will not be returning to the castle, not yet. I'm on a very important expedition. Mm. One which may take some time. Could you wait for me in Eastpool? Until my journey is complete, I will come back for you then. I promise. Of course, Your Grace. For you, I would gladly wait until my dying day. That says it. And that's that. You know it. <laughs> oh man, ecstatic boy. Boy, I told y'all, boy. Boy, I told you. The Rossfields was going to come back. Thank you, both of you. You've been most kind. The memory of serving the late Archduke was his one light in the darkness. And now that light burns a little more brightly. It's nothing but a fantasy, of course. But it's better than the truth of the matter. A damn sight better. The 
The blight is on our doorstep. Our harvests are failing. The people are leaving in droves. If it weren't for Lady Hannah selling half her worldly goods to provide for the few of us who stayed behind, we would long since have starved. Damn. We want to keep the bearers safe here, we really do. But unless a miracle happens, we won't be able to spare a crust of bread to share between them soon enough. Is it really that bad? So bad, I even petitioned the Imperial garrison to take them. But when they found out where they'd come from, they damn near spat in our faces. Ducal dogs, they called them. Enemies of the Empire. I know a man named Sid, who would gladly give a home to any bearer in need of one. Leave this with me. As soon as I return from Phoenix Gate, I'll speak with him. Thank you, my lord. Will you be passing through Eastpool on your way back? I should very much like to speak with you again, if you have the time, regarding the future of the village. And what might be done for Lady Hannah? After all, she's done for us. Yes, of course. I'll be back anon. Fare you well, my lord, my lady. I wish you a safe journey. Appreciate that, my boy. Quest complete! Back in the day, and I was younger, not a kid anymore. Must be on our way, old man. Let me check my man. Listen, you know, I know, you know, I know, you know, I know, you know, and I know, you know what time it is, man. It is those with the most coast, coast, cutting the close, anything, leave you shaving the toes. I am back in action. Let's make it happen. You need a stretch when we got the magic. You dig me, man. Listen, we're making our way through. Probably like a little side hustle type episode. Not really a main story type episode. We ain't really do no main story like stuff. Besides, get some new duds. You feel me? You feel me? My boy got that all leather on, scrapped up. I like that red though. What swaggy? Gauntlets, tough. Legs, smooth. Cape, always welcome. You feel me? I just need my boy to get that 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 haircut he had back when he was younger. Cause I ain't really a fan. Of the all black Dante hairstyle from Devil May Cry, like I, I like the, I like it when it's all white on Dante, but this is like the typical light Shimagami anime hairstyle. I, I want something different. You feel me? Like what he had before it was like half Sasuke, half slick back. That was pretty cool, but this right here, this is like every anime character's hairstyle, period. But you know what I'm saying? I mean, it suits him. Don't get me wrong. Like he's still swaggy though. I need to get this mark off the side of my face, but that's besides the point. But all in all, man, remember the model, man, we are gamers. I love you. I'll catch you next login. Don't forget to hit that like button on your way out. And remember, whatever you put your time, effort, and energy to is what you become. So go out there and be great. Do not be ordinary. Be extraordinary. And I love you. And we'll catch you next login. Peace. But you see the drip, though. You see the drip. With the crimson red, the scarlet? Too much.